Cherry, so I heard that you were going to do some cooking videos and I recently tried to make some pancakes and they didn't come out too well. I was wondering if you wouldn't mind trying to make me some real pancakes because you're my bitch in the kitchen. Okay, bye! Hey guys, so today is the second episode of Cherry's Kitchen and today I thought I'd cook pancakes as pancakes day is next Tuesday and you cannot have enough pancakes. Pancakes are awesome. So I'm going to have to quickly put an apron on as I don't really want to get pancake mixture down me. That's better. Right, so we're going to need our ingredients to begin with. 100 grams of flour, a pinch of salt, half a pint of milk, and one egg. Bollocks. I even have a throne for my egg. Yeah, I won't smash you. Well, not yet, anyway. I might smash you in a little bit because I need to use you, but for the time being, you're safe. So once you weigh that on your ingredients, you're going to need to get a bowl. Sieving time. I like sieving. Now it's time to break you. Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry it couldn't work out between us, but I prefer pancakes. I love pancakes a lot more than you, so... I'm like a pro pancake maker, by the way, just in case you were wondering how good I am at making pancakes. No! Why are you going lumpy? Stop it! Once you've got all the lumps out, which probably shouldn't be there, it's time to get your pan. Skills. I've told you, I'm a pro. Now you'll need to get a frying pan. Right. Don't juggle with kitchen things. If you're a lazy cook like me, you're probably going to want to get some of this. It's basically spray oil, and you can just be like, boom, 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 and then you're done, and it saves all the mess, and then, you know, so simple. Oh, I forgot to put the salt in, I forgot to put the salt in! Now, if you're a complete pro like me, you're probably going to end up forgetting to put an ingredient in. So you just want to put that in last and hope that no one notices. It's fine. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. Now depending on if you're a fat bitch like me, you're either going to want a thin pancake or a thick pancake. I'm going to go for a medium sort of size pancake because you can't go wrong. It's a little bit of big and it's a little bit of small. It works. So when your pan's kind of smoking, which I'm pretty sure it shouldn't be doing that, you want to get your ingredients and you just want to just put it in there whether it's lumpy or not, and then just swish it about a bit, and you just want to hope for the best, but the best thing is, you don't need to hope for the best, because you know you're amazing at cooking, so you know that it can't go wrong, and it's really lumpy, but let's just ignore that, shall we? I totally cannot smell burning right now. Can you smell burning? No, didn't think so. I certainly can't smell burning. We've got some movement, so this means that like we're getting very close to tossing zone. Tossing zone. Tossing zone. So while you're waiting for it to cook, uh, why not get a drink, you know? Because it's apparently going to take longer than you thought it was going to take. But it's just taking that a little bit longer, which is a bit annoying because I'm a bit hungry right now. So I'm just going to have to have like a liquid lunch instead. It's fine. Oh, I think I'm... It's loose. I can toss it now. Are you ready? I've never tossed a pancake before. I mean, yes, I have. I'm a pro. I have. I, I've tossed millions of pancakes. It's fine. You ready? I'm not. Nah! No! Nah! No! Right, I think this one is done now. And I'm just going to move all this shit out of the way. Because we don't need it. The wine can stay there because that's fine. And then you just sort of slip it onto the plate like so. And then you're like, wow, pancakes. So I've decided to go for a butter, sugar and lemon juice, if I can find any. You're probably thinking, Cherry, why do you need a butter that's that big? I don't know. It's as big as my head. It's ridiculous. You're going to want to get your butter and you're just going to want to slide it on there. Just make it all moist and nice and it's going to look really good. And you're just going to want to eat it. I mean, just look, it's just melting into it. It's absolutely divine. So once you've got all your butter on there, just drop the knife in there. Who cares? And then you want to chop your lemon without cutting your finger off because I'm prone to being clumsy, but let's just forget about that. So once you've got your other lemon half, you want to just squeeze it on, just squeeze it. Oh, you just... So you want to get your sugar bowl. I mean, I was about to use a spoon, but I've noticed that it's got like a little pour thing. So maybe we can just pour it on. Yeah. Who needs spoons when you've got a pourer? 
and then you want to just wrap it up like a little sausage duvet it's fine now you've got like the perfect pancake I mean it just looks absolutely beautiful just look at that look at it you couldn't get any better if you tried so now I'm going to taste test it and who needs a fork because I'm a lady hmm hmm that's really good hmm so I've been Cherry and that's how to make pancakes if you'd like to make your own then please feel free to make a video response because I'd love to see how pro you are in the kitchen. Also don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and all that jazz and if you want to go follow me on Twitter because Twitter's the best place to be, you should know that already. And if you want to see last week's video then it's over here somewhere, not sure which size, I never do but who cares. I've got pancakes, I've got a glass of wine and you don't. I'm still single so uh, boys, if you want some pancakes you know where to come. Over and out guys, bye!